for any athlete that depends on upper body strength, it's a potentially devastating injury. Uh, clearly one that if he does have an intact, uh, in fact, a torn rotator cuff, would greatly impair his ability to fight properly. So, uh, for a young, healthy individual, he knows when he tears his rotator cuff. Um, uh, from the media reports I've read, it happened two to three weeks before the fight in, in a sparring session. Uh, they, they recognized an event, he felt pain, and had some impairment um, and had some difficulty from that point forward. In fact, they changed the way he was going to fight in order to compensate for whatever deficiencies he had in his arm strength. Uh, I think the chances are good he will be very good. Uh, when you're dealing with the top 1% of the world, it's hard to get back to that excellent level after an injury like this. It's possible, but it's definitely not definite that he'll get back to that same level. Um, I probably wouldn't have cleared him to fight. Um, from a, for a lot of reasons, uh, one being his own protection, uh, but two, I don't think he can be anywhere close to an, uh, an, the normal fighter with this type of injury.